Hi, it's Alaska Granny. Are you worried about prepping for the future? Maybe even thinking food is too expensive. Maybe it's too late. Maybe you can't afford to do any prepping. That food is just too much. And that is a reality. It's becoming more and more expensive. But if we don't scrape together a little bit of money today, what are we going to do in the future if we still don't have any money but food costs even more so that's one of the reasons why it's important to buy some extra food today we can see the prices are going up if you stock up on food a little at a time and just keep adding a little tiny bit at a time over time it becomes a substantial amount of food and you would be pleasantly surprised on how many meals you can make out of that food if you plan it strategically it is becoming harder and harder for families to afford food. Just look at the statistics from one of the food banks that was recently in the news. Demand is up 60%, while donations are down 50%. This is a reflection of the crisis of hunger and food shortages that are occurring for so many families in today's economy. I was recently on a trip overseas and I met a man in Malaysia who told me when the pandemic first happened, everybody was excited. Okay, we now get a holiday. We can relax, lay around, take some time off, enjoy our families. And then it dragged on and on and on. And then he didn't have a job for two full years. He's so thankful that they've opened again. Tourism is coming back. He said it will stick with him for the rest of his life that he didn't have enough food for his family. And as soon as he had any money again, he bought pounds and pounds of rice. And it had never occurred to him ever before to make sure that he had rice on hand for his family. It's not too late to stock up on some basic beans and rice. Just look here at the prices at Walmart. You can get an eight pound bag of pinto beans for $6.88. That eight pounds of beans has 104 servings at 120 calories each for a total of 12,480 calories. 20 pounds of rice at Walmart is $11.14. The 20 pound bag of rice has 202 servings at 160 calories each for a total of 32,320 calories. If you combine the beans and rice, which make a perfect protein, you have 44,800 calories in just those two packages of food. If you average 2,000 calories per day, you have 22 days worth of food for an emergency for only $18. So when we look at some of the news, it's so gloom and doom. And sometimes we let that get into our heart and we feel like we are defeated. You can't do that. Don't destroy your own hope for the future and suck the energy out of yourself with negative thoughts. Figure out how can I plan for the future so that I'll be able to take care of myself and make the best out of each day. We want to enjoy the life that we have. We don't want to crush our own dreams. We want to take care of ourselves and go forward trying to make each day the best we can. That's why I'm a prepper. I want every day to be the best. I'm not looking forward to gloom and doom and I don't want to focus on those things. I want to look forward that I'm going to be okay because I'm preparing the way to smooth it out is food storage is lifestyle insurance so that I'll have the things I need no matter what happens. So let us know, can you find these foods for a better price where you are? I hope you'll take this to heart, get some extra food, put it away for the future. I hope you'll like my video, that you will share my video with someone else you think might enjoy it, and please subscribe to the Alaska Granny channel.